Um, today I will be showing you guys some um, really good finger foods, or I guess finger snacks for babies that are about nine months old. Um, this video is highly requested, so I figured I would just finally get around to doing it. I'm sorry it took me so long, um, but I'll just jump right in. So these things that I'm going to be showing you are all bought, and none of them are homemade. So, but they are fairly inexpensive, um, depending how often you feed them to your baby, I guess. Um, but anyways, okay, so the first thing that I absolutely love giving to my baby are, hang on, these uh, yogurt melts. They are from Gerber. They look like this. They come in dozens of flavors, and they're made with, some of them are made with fruit and veggies, some are made with just fruit, but it's always yogurt included. So they're yogurt melts. And the best part is that there's no preservatives, no artificial flavors or sweeteners. They dissolve easily in the baby's mouth. They taste incredible. You'll probably eat the whole bag yourself. You gotta contain yourself. Um, I'll show you what they look like. So there's this. I've already taken some out, but there's that's what I guess kind of what's in there. And they look like this. And you just put a couple in your baby's high chair tray, or if you're in the buggy in the tray in front of them, if you're in the mall or something, they can just pick at them, eat them, and you don't have to worry about them choking because it dissolves in their mouth. Even if they swallow it whole and start panicking, it still will dissolve in their throat from the saliva, so there's absolutely no choking involved. It does say 12 months on the bag, but you can give it to your baby at 9 months. I really don't see why not. I've been giving it to him since 8 months, and he's been doing fine. Um, they say it's for babies who are walking, um, but you don't really need your baby to be walking. As long as they can sit and support themselves in a high chair, they can have these, um, at least in my opinion. Um, okay, the next thing, which are for babies who are nine months, I say, or crawlers. These are also from Gerber. I do like buying Gerber because even though some of the, some of the products that they have aren't organic, they are, always have no artificial colors or flavors and no preservatives, which is really important to me. So these are puffs. They're whole grain and rice puff cereal with real apple, and this is a strawberry apple flavor. So it looks like this. They're little stars, and they pretty much dissolve in the baby's mouth as well. I haven't opened this yet because I just bought it brand new. I ran out from like the other container that I had, but um, pretty much, like these were I think three around three fifty each. Um, I got these from Target. Oh, it's gonna be forever to open it. I don't even know if I can open it for you guys, but they are little, um, just little stars. Just, again, babies can pick up feed them themselves. They taste amazing, so your kid will love it. The next thing are these mixed berry carrot naturally flavored fruit and vegetable snacks. Um, they look like this. And pretty much, they are just like a fruit, like a fruit stick. But I break them into little pieces and put them on John's tray, like hide your tray for him to eat, and he picks up them. They taste amazing. These are organic. You can get them at Zares or really any grocery stores, and they taste incredible. It's all just 100% fruit. So the next items are these baby mum biscuits. I've been talking about them for so many months now. You can get them, give them to your baby from as young as six months, and they have ones that go like higher up to toddler and things like that. Um, these are incredible because they are organic. Some of them, only some of the flavors are organic. But they are also gluten and egg and peanut free. They dissolve easily. There's no mess. There's no preservatives. No artificial colors or flavors. Blah, blah, blah. So good for your baby. You don't have to feel guilty about giving these to your baby. And they taste very, very, very good. I eat them a lot too when I'm hungry because they're such healthy snacks. So they come individually packaged. Well, there's two in a pack. But there's um, 12 packs in one box. And you literally just pull the cracker out and give the whole cracker to your baby and they'll take as many bites as they want. And they can take as big of a bite as they want because it dissolves in their mouth so there's no choking or anything like, thing like that. It's so, so good. Um, and it tastes great, like I said. And these are perfect if you don't want a mess and you're in like a, like a clothing store shopping and your baby's whining. You pull one of these out, give it to them, and there's absolutely, you know, they stop crying and there's no mess. Don't worry about them, worry about them getting any, you know, junk on clothes and stuff like that. So these are definitely like a must. I have boxes and boxes of these. And again, they come in different flavors. Um, so I would just stock up if I were you. The next thing are these um, arrowroot cookies. These do say 12 months, like for toddlers, but I think it just really depends on your baby. John's like very strong. He's been sitting since he was four months. He can support himself really well. He's almost walking. He's taken like um, six, his first six steps by himself the other day. So like he's, I feel like he's old enough to have these. They look like, they're organic, which is amazing. And arrowroot, I think, if I'm right, is supposed to help with teething, I'm pretty sure. It's a type of flower. Well, it's a type of root, but it's the arrowroot flour that they make it with. And the cookies look like this, just a little flour cookie. They taste pretty good. They're not bad at all. And I give it to John, and he just 
eats it like a cookie, like an adult eats a normal cookie. It's so cute. Um, so if you think your baby's okay, like, you know, old enough to have these, absolutely. Again, these melt in the mouth pretty easily. Like, they dissolve, they like not dissolve, but, like, they get pretty mushy from all this baby saliva. And babies have a ton of saliva. So I feel like if your baby's around eight months, they're probably old enough to have some. So, again, really, really, really good snack if you're just looking to keep your baby quiet for a few minutes while you're getting some things done. The other thing that aren't really finger foods, but I kind of want to show, share it with you guys because I am like obsessed with them, are Mott's Fruit Sensations and Veggies. Now, they come in many, different, many, many different flavors like blueberry and things like that. This is peach, apple, um, carrot flavor, and they're little individual containers, and they're almost like an applesauce texture, but they taste insane. And can I just read you the ingredients because let me just tell you, they are amazing. Apples, water, concentrated carrot juice, concentrated, um, more concentrated, clarified carrot juice, there's cucumber juice, there's natural flavor, bell pepper juice for coloring, so there's no artificial colors, um, fruit and vegetable juices for color, and concentrated lemon juice. That's it. You can give this to your baby and not feel like you're giving them crap. This is good stuff. Excuse my language. But it's so good, and there's absolutely no sugar added to it, so it's just all natural healthy. It's like giving your baby a handful of fruits. It tastes incredible. Now, this you have to give them with a spoon, but it takes three seconds, and if, if they're like, you need a quick snack on the road. What I like to do is, I'll actually open it, because I want to show you guys um, what works really well for me, if I can get one out, is I open up this, I peel it back just ever so slightly that there's a little opening, and I let the child kind of drink and suck from it. So he kind of will put his mouth on it and be like... And he knows what's going on. And he just kind of gets them out until it's all done. And it's clean, no mess, and it tastes fabulous. So, and I like these for myself too. Finally, another one of my favorite all-time snacks, which you guys probably know about since your baby was like six months old, are Cheerios. I didn't even bother bringing a box. You guys know what Cheerios look like. Um, I give John Cheerios all the time, almost every day, um, on his high chair to eat. A lot of times I will throw them in a Ziploc bag. Throw them in the diaper bag and take them when I'm on the road. Um, you know, and I need to give him a quick snack. He has a little tray on his car seat. So he likes to just pick, pick food off of. So it works out for me. Um, if you're not comfortable giving your baby um, Cheerios, because I know that they're not the greatest. I mean, there is sugar added to it. There's a lot of stuff in there that's probably not the best for your baby. Um, then these are all the ones things I showed you are all perfect um, substitutes because they are so healthy. So, um, anyways, I hope you found this video extremely helpful. Um, I hope you'll give these things, these products a try. I promise your baby will love them, and so will you. So, thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye.